What's up guys, welcome back to another episode of Brawler vs. Brawl Ball. Today we're going to focus on Dynamite, another Trophy Road winner and reward that you receive. Um, and uh, for those of you who have just unlocked Dynamite, um, he's a ton of fun and uh, actually a, a, an underrated uh, Brawl Ball player. Um, for those of you who just unlocked or are in the process of unlocking, uh, Dynamite lobs two explosive sticks of Dynamite. His super attack is a whole barrel full of dynamite that blows up cover. He is absolutely destructive. And uh, as far as star powers are concerned, good luck getting these guys. First one is Dyna Jump. This one is uh, a bit of a nuanced play. One that's a little tougher to master but allows you to jump over cover. And the other one is straightforward damage to your super. An extra 1,000 damage to your super, which is the one we're going to go with for Brawl Ball. Uh, just to add a little extra damage and a little extra flair to the battlefield. Let's take a look at the map. Chose Dynamite for this Brawl Ball map because there's just a ton of cover, which means a lot of things to blow up and uh, really kind of wheedle at the opponent as much as possible. So my overall goal and what I'm hoping to get when I get matched up with these randoms is at least one other brawler who can interrupt or disrupt the ball um, from the ball carrier on the other side. In other words, I don't want my super to be the only one that has the ability to dislodge that ball. So we're going to jump in. Do three matches back to back to back and uh, hopefully learn a thing or two. Alright, we are up against a Frank, a Spike, and a Shelly. I've got my scorer in Mortis, or at least I hope he's a scorer. And then we've got Shelly. Uh, Spike is going to be more of their utility guy. He's going to be a pain in the butt if he gets hit, an, enough hits on us to the point where uh, he's slowing down the battlefield. That's never fun. I've already got my first super up. I'm going to use that to blow up cover immediately. And uh, with that, a brawler. Shelly's coming for me. i got to do what I can to keep her away. She's the other one who can blow up cover, obviously. And then you've got Frank. Frank is just an absolute beast to brawl ball, uh, depending on how that Frank plays in particular. Um, this one looks pretty competent so far overall. Not going ahead and just spamming a super for the sake of spamming it and blowing things up. Um, so it was being smart about it. Also got me there because I thought he was going inside. He went outside. I'm going to try to get rid of that Shelly. Mort, get up there, dude. Passing to you. Well, I was going to. Alright. I'm trying to control this Frank as much as possible. And open it up for Mort. And there he goes. Alright. Let's rinse and repeat, guys. Right now, the battlefield is definitely favoring us. Uh, however, that did not help. Spike laid down just the perfect slow trap and uh, dominated me. We got lucky. Thank you, Mort. Uh, Ismag, you did great. I hope you want to play again. Love playing with Mortises, especially when they know what they're doing. Uh, if not, hey... Looks like I'm riding solo. Okay, so another Frank. Uh, so we're going to want to control the Frank, but they got a Primo as well. So he's going to be tough to watch for. Um, and then Jesse is is very underrated as well, I feel like, in Brawl Ball. Can do just a ton of damage uh, with the properly laid turret. So we got to look out for her. Uh, our Primo is moving it, and so is our Frank. So, hey, I didn't have to do a whole lot other than disrupt and explode uh, the cover to open it up. So... All right, there Frank is blowing us up. Get a little support to the Primo. Jesse's trying to set up their Frank, so I'm just trying to stop that from happening. Our Primo's doing work. I'm going to step up, actually advance the ball, and I'm going to bail. There you go, Frank. Good job, 2004. Oh, almost got there, Frank. And working on their Primo. I'm really just doing everything I can to let them have a, a nice clean win here. I'm going to go ahead and let Primo take that in. And we're going to enjoy win number two. Good work, guys. So as you can see, Dynamite can really just kind of explode all over the battlefield on Brawl Ball. Really disrupt the way uh, that, that your opponents want to play the game, and it, it can be just a royal pain. The goal is just to really kind of be accurate with your throwing, uh, which is, can be tough to do early on when you really can't see what's going on with all this cover. 
So as long as I land a, a couple good early ones, we're generally in good shape, which I have not yet been able to do in this match, but uh, I want to protect our Frank, or, and I, I failed to do that, and that's what happens. So I was trying to get that Shelly down. Um, I was afraid of the cover going, and, and that's exactly what happened. So let's not end in a loss here, guys. All right. That Primo's down. We got a bow that's just causing problems. So let's try to get him down. I'm at least going to try to back him up. All right. So. Really just trying to... There we go. I wanted to get at least one of them down. Um, I am alone now. And, uh... The good thing is they don't have a super, so I'm hoping my teammates are out. They are. Ah, but too little, too late. That's all right. We ended on a, on a, on a loss, but we saw two great wins back-to-back. -back. Um, overall, the way that we control the battlefield with Dynamite in this particular Brawl Ball map, and in Brawl Ball in general, um, is, is actually really, really nice. Fortunately, uh, if you get matched up randomly with either a Primo or a Frank, or a Shelly, or someone with a little bit more control, um, it opens up you to really kind of take advantage of the other comp. It really kind of doesn't matter what it is. Um, the one Dynamite killer, and, and really the counter, surprisingly, that I've noticed is Tick at some times on here, and then the, the other one can be Barley, just because it, the, uh, the range is a little bit different. Um, it gives you a little less freedom to roam around, especially with the dot on the AOE surface, so so you want to try to avoid that. But Dynamite is actually a, a really, really fun Brawl Ball player, and uh, hopefully you picked up just a couple of different tips and tricks while using them. If you did, feel free to go ahead and comment below. Uh, let others know what tips and tricks you may have. And if you like this content, please feel free to subscribe to the channel. We'll be doing a lot more of this. Thanks, guys.